child's home. She would enter and leave a gift, just in case that child was the one she didn't want to miss. Every good child seemed to be the one, and so Befana's work was never done. Every time she gives a gift, but how does she do it? She's so swift. Her sack is always full of toys. It must be a miracle, girls and boys. She would cry if they weren't nice. Every tear of hers froze to ice in front of their door for all to see. A crystallized pile like a sad frozen tree marking the spot where kindness was not. Bethana's sack is really heavy. She enters a church by chance. Inside, there is a crowd of people staring at the altar with reverence. Up on the altar, something is there. There is a family with an infant in their care. Angels, animals, and three kings beyond compare. They all were there. Befana starts to run. She's running in the air. Her heart beat faster and faster. She would have risked any disaster. Because of her age, they made room. She stepped onto the altar with her sack and broom. In front of all the congregation, she prepared to make her presentation. Breathless with emotion, her face full of devotion. She holds out the little present toward the baby who looks so pleasant. For your majesty, the king. Just a little tiny thing. This special baby doesn't fuss. What a pure and holy scene. But how odd. No one's breathing. Befana thought she must be dreaming. One of the kings suddenly faces Befana and speaks. His voice is low and earnest, but his words make her feel weak. Your place, my dear, it is not here among mere statues. But have no fear, Instead, your place is out there giving to all real children who are living. Anna goes outside to do her part, full of feelings in her heart. January 6th, 
she will repeat her trip and she will try to see all the children in Italy. Befana will never get discouraged. She will look and look. No one will be forgotten. That's the job she undertook. And this is the Italian legend of Befana. With sack and broom in her hand, she reminds us to show kindness to everyone in every land. Foreigners too, include them in. And if they speak with an accent, just tune in. With the needy, share all you've got, whether rich or poor, whether handsome or not. The message from Befana as she soars up above is to shower all people with charity and with love. Even those without halos and wings. After all, we are all human beings.